What's going on everyone and welcome back to another Talking Freight. In the last episode, we talked about the top trends for inbound freight that we're seeing in 2020, which wrapped up our extensive inbound series. In case you missed it, you can watch the whole playlist on our channel. But in this episode, we start a new series around the world of Omnichannel. To start things off, we're gonna talk about why shippers are mastering e-commerce to go Omnichannel. So let's talk e-commerce and Omnichannel. Although e-commerce makes up 10% of overall retail sales, its value in the modern economy must not be underestimated. There's been much discussion about the retail apocalypse and retailers around the globe are clamoring about how they can achieve success and avoid the imminent doom. This answer lies in developing omni-channel experiences for customers, unifying the online and brick and mortar experience into a seamless shopping journey. Unfortunately, shippers may overlook the biggest obstacle to Omnichannel, developing effective e-commerce shipping practices. To avoid the retail apocalypse and achieve Omnichannel success, shippers need to understand the challenges of e-commerce shipping, how it contributes to Omnichannel success, and a few tips to succeed in it. So first, let's talk about the unique challenges that come with e-commerce shipping. Shippers may lack the physical resources, like warehousing space, necessary to handle e-commerce shipping. Shippers will also face an uphill battle in managing the higher rate of returns through e-commerce sales. E-commerce shipping is complicated with an average return rate of 30%. Meanwhile, 49% of shippers now offer free return shipping. So managing a returns process with minimal costs is essential to maintaining profitability. Shippers that fail to consider the implications of returns by refusing to give customers information about returns costs and procedures before purchase could risk alienating up to 67% of shoppers. In addition, shippers may lack the resources necessary to push operations beyond availability and reliability of procurement. As a result, manufacturers may choose to work with other resellers. Even transferring the burden of e-commerce shipping to small packages or outsourcing to a major carrier may not necessarily work. Major carriers using air shipping may have priority shipping over other smaller carriers, creating delays and the once perceived fastest means of shipping. As a result, shippers need to think beyond air shipping in developing a successful e-commerce shipping strategy. Next, mastery of e-commerce shipping leads to omni-channel success. Omni-channel success depends on the ability to move orders from brick and mortar stores, online shopping platforms, social media, shopping, TV advertising, and traditional phone orders. An effective e-commerce shipping solution builds the framework necessary for full integration and implementation of an omni-channel supply chain strategy. Ultimately, building a connection between all parts of the supply chain is essential to e-commerce and therefore it's essential to omni-channel success. Shippers should work to integrate existing systems, leveraging software as a service or SaaS, and an e-commerce ready transportation management system or TMS. So now let's look at 10 ways to excel at e-commerce shipping and supply chain management. E-commerce shipping and supply chain management must consider the unique needs of e-commerce shoppers, which range from speedy delivery to combining multi-product orders into a single shipment from multiple locations. To overcome the challenges in e-commerce shipping, shippers should do these 10 things. Number one, connect warehouses and supply chain management systems. Number two, offer free, fast shipping when appropriate. Number three, balance value-added services with business goals. Number four, regionalize inventory. Number five, use technology to get the best rates. Number six, focus on core values. Number seven, select a proven e-commerce logistics partner. Number eight, ensure quality and accuracy in e-commerce orders. Number nine, use connected devices to track shipments in real time. And number 10, keep customers informed. So here are my final thoughts. The demand for omni-channel customer experiences has increased dramatically. 
Customers want to review a product online, visit the store to feel the texture of the product, complete a purchase online, and have it shipped to their sister's, aunt's, cousin's house. Yes, it's complex, and omnichannel customer experiences are redefining the levels of customer service. For shippers implementing omnichannel supply chain strategies, it's the end goal. But they must learn to walk before they can run. In other words, shippers must first master e-commerce shipping and supply chain management before attempting to develop a robust omnichannel experience. However, some companies with the right resources and tools have the potential to develop e-commerce strategies in conjunction with omnichannel plans. So what's your organization waiting for? Well, that's it for today. See you again next week. Hold up, before you go, make sure you hit that subscribe button. You'll get up to the minute info from Fast Freight 5, educational material from Talking Freight, and the best voices in the industry from the Freight Project Podcast.